Welcome to the madness! Alright folks, how's it going? Today's Daffy and welcome to another episode of Darkest Dungeon Season 2 Modded for Crimson Quartz. Right, okay, so just a little bit of a series update before we uh, before we carry on. So, uh, by the time this video goes up, this will be the Wednesday. So, I apologise for no stream over the last few days. So, Sunday, um, I was doing my weekly... A weekly game night with some pals of mine, Dungeons and Dragons, if you're interested. Um, Monday night, I was busy and I was mentally effed, <laughs> so I couldn't do a stream. And I tried to do a stream tonight as of Tuesday night. However, my internet is got worse. Yeah, it really, really has got worse. And to tell you the truth, it's a mixture of fatigue at the same time because. I don't know how I did it last year, but honestly, I'm not going to lie, I've been keeping it quiet for the last couple of weeks because I didn't want to take anything from the episodes, but streaming has really, really, really knackered me out. I'm not lying, honestly. I mean, for those who haven't been watching my videos over the last few months, I was doing streaming um, once a week up until about May of this year, and that's because I was trying to get myself ready for this whole month of streaming. And it really has taken a lot of me, you know, trying to make sure I'm doing decent uh, commentary as well as trying to interact with you guys at the same time. And to be honest with you, I cannot multitask. So I think what I'm going to do from this point forward is I think I'm just going to record the rest of the episodes of the series, if you don't mind. You're still going to get your content, but obviously it's not live, so I apologize. You're not going to see my reactions or see things real time, but I think quality wise... I think it's just better if I just start recording. I might go back to streaming in maybe a few days time, maybe a week, we'll see. If I can manage to get back in the driver's seat, but we'll just see what happens. Anyway, enough of my waffling, I do apologise. So anyway, let's let's get on with the episode the last, shall we? Right, okie dokie then. So, we are going to be doing the, uh, we're going to do a little bit more progress with the Baron today, I think. I think that's what I got set up for, because we do have the Baron, uh, we do have the Baron highlighted actually. And we do have um, some people. We have Kaldor, we have Howie, we have Eve, and we have Babins. Okay. Um, we got the Caution Cloak them. Yeah. Yeah, we'll, we'll give him to that, I think. We'll give him the Caution Cloak. Might as well. Now, there was something I wanted to give to Howie. I did want to change up some of his stuff, actually. Um, we got Phonetic Rights, which is very nice. I mean, healing skills, we can give that to somebody. Um, I was thinking the Book of Rage for him actually increases damage more. It's possible, that's what I was thinking. Yeah, I think I might give him the Book of Rage instead of the Slippery Boots. Because all it is, it's just, uh, it's just less... Yeah, all it is is just less crits, that's it. So, personally, giving him 10% extra damage and then a further 10% damage and if HP below 66% and 33 accordingly, I mean, that's an, almost a grand total of... <laughs> 55% damage, and not to mention mixing in with uh, Collect Bounty, I mean, that's pretty nice if you ask me. So yeah, so I think we'll do that then. Um, also as well, I've updated Stukov's uh, potions, scrolls, and his items mods, so we got some new stuff. I've also done some edits regarding the heroes themselves. I've taken away a couple of items per class near enough, or some classes, and I've maybe changed the quantity of some items, but basically we've got some different stuff. So, let's get started then. Yep, we're going to shoot one invitation and we're going to see what we can do. Okay, so we have three holy water, we've got two potions of shield faith, we've got three torches, four food, we've got an oil of keen edges, we have two potions of heroism, we have a silver nectar. Now, this is going to be kind of interesting because the silver nectar here, um, I believe it's, it's one of the consumable items, but what happens is we actually have a new mechanic regarding his stuff. So, you know, not only just potion fever and spell plague, but we also have Addictions now, which is very, very, very dangerous. So we'll see what that does. Two scores of Bless, four potions, clear wounds, and of course a bottle of spirits. So, let's get ourselves a full stack of food. 16. Also, I've got the prices as well. I think we've got the prices to the original stuff. Um, I made stack torches, 8. Instead of the 10. But even then, we don't really need that much because we're not going to be using torchlight. Um, we'll take some bandages. Uh, we'll take two medicinal herbs. Um, actually, no. We'll take three bandages, but instead what we're going to do is we're going to need to take three vials of blood. 
one for each. I mean, we've got one in craving. Yeah, I've just got one in craving so far, and the rest are fine. So we're just going to take three blood for treasures, trinkets, as well as some other things. So, without further ado, let's get started. Right, okay, so we're back in the courtyard then. Interesting. Very interesting. All right, well, let's see what madness we can go up to today, eh? Let's see what madness we can go up to today. So, yeah, so I'm going to be a little rusty. It's been, like I said, it's been a few days. A few days, huh? Just hearing the eldritch howl just beckon me back into the courtyard. <laughs> All right, let's go. Let's go. Okay, so we so we left off where? Aha, in the sense of right. Okay, so we know that's a battle. That's a curio. And we got battle and a curio here. Right, let's head down the way though. This is where I wanted to be originally. So let's see what we can do. Okay, empty corridor. It's fine. All right, let's see what's in this room. Nothing and no skeletons. So it's literally an empty room. Okay. Oh, yeah, we got battle. Okay, that's fine. Alright, so we have a Chevalier. Cheval Chevalier, that's what these guys are, Chevalier. Okay, alright, let's go for a... Let's go. 80%. 30 percent protection. Caltrops I could go with, actually. Because that 50... Yeah, do you want know to go for Caltrops? Because it'll give him a 15% damage taken. Of course, just like any other Baron run, this is primarily going to be um, just a progressive quest. I'm not aiming to do all this in one go, I just want to see how far we can go. Not to mention, I am doing my best at not looking at a map. I'm trying to be as blind as I possibly can for this. So, we'll see regardless. 11 damage, not bad. Okay, give me blood. Unnerved. Unbalanced. Yeah. Okay, it's cool though, because what we can do is we've got... Okay, we haven't got anti-venom, that's fine. Um, I'm going to be a little bit more preemptive with the... Uh, I'm going to be more preemptive with the the items this time. But for now, I don't think we need it. So, let's go um, race the gun. Go arc of a shot, and we should go 7 to 13. Max damage, awesome. Okay, and then what we can do is we can go... Let's see, Black Bounty is only... Oh, so that's it. So finish him, which was originally on a position 3, is now on a position 2. But we can go come collect Bouncy anyway and do some damage. Very nice. Give them no quarter. Do you know, I'll be honest with you, I know the Hero Forge class is overpowered, but I actually do like these changes. <laughs> it just gives them a little bit more flavor, you know? Confidence. But of course, I know people's got their opinions, but hey. It'll be fine to feel a little stronger than usual for the season. Besides, I'm starting watching um, season one again from uh, last year. Just I'm basically going from my playlist, just watching all my old videos to see like not only how far I've come, but to see if I made any improvement, which I like to think I have, maybe. And then try and learn from some past mistakes and trying to correct them today and maybe change some flavor up or something. Let's see. Anyway, 750 gold, four holy waters. Not bad. Not bad at all. Uh, okay. So yeah, just basically just a general comparison of what I like in past capacity today. See what I need to change, see what I don't need to change, you know, like a malarkey. I mean, one of the things is actually my, uh, my vanity, because I'm not joking. <laughs> the last year I was a lot more prolific with certain things. <laughs> so yeah, so I think I have worked on that over the last couple of months or so. Maybe. You might, you might hear the odd F word and stuff, but you know. Uh, okay, actually, I just want to check. So my face come on and voice come through okay? Yep. All right, perfect. Okay, right, so we've got several... Okay, so we've got the Quartzen and the Slave from Ghoul. Um, okay, I think... Let's go come hither. Bring her to the front. They'll also get a mark on ready for next time. Okay, so, right, we'll have to use the Blood with the Vestal now because she's wasting. That's fine. Now, can you tell she's wasting from the little bugs around her? What are you doing? Well... 25% damage? <laughs> oh no. Oh no. No, 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 no. Oh my god. This better go free. This better go free. Come on. Good. Yeah. Screw your buff. I feel relaxed. Calm. Yep. Good. Stress relief. Okay. Let's grab blood. And you know what I think we'll do? We'll grab the scroll of less. Okay. Resist the spell, Blake. We've got horror up. That's completely fine. Um, yeah, let's go for a party all. A momentary abatement. 
Okay, just keep everybody topped. Let's go brace the gun. And we'll go arc shot. So, take it. Ooh, it's Altoon again. Sure. Nice. God, I love this Nasser. I really do. Just the way they look, the way they handle, and the way they play. Honestly, this is amazing. Uh, okay, so we're not going to do much in terms of a stun here. So instead what we'll do is we'll get a full heal for the Shinasuri. Perfect. And then the mark is... Yeah, the mark's gone, but it's fine. Start smacking into him when we collect Bouncy with Howie. You're craving now, that's fine. Um, I don't want to use, like, spirits or anything, for a chance. No, it should be alright. Okay, let's go for Smite. Ah, that's a dodge. Alright. Okay, keep firing. That's a six. We will chip him down eventually. Rend. Okay, Rend's not bad, as long as they'll do the bloody skull toss. Yeah, I know, but I need to wait until you're braving. So, yeah, we'll just keep chopping them down. Little by little. Little by little. Just standard attrition tactics. That's all it is. A brilliant confluence of skill and purpose. All right. Spike horror. Uh huh. So, get them in stress now. Oh, no, it's just got, um. Yeah, nice way stress. Okay. Um, right. Let's go for another stun if possible. Nope, resist it. Okay, that's fine. Just want to do a little bit of damage anyway, because that was a kill. The bigger the beast. Nice. The great okay, what we got? Okay, we got three potions of magic weapons. Ooh, this potion will mildly increase damage for a price. Yeah. Pretty good, actually. Very, very good. And do you know, what's, do you know what the funny thing is, though? Um, do you know what? I think I know what... Um, I think I know what file name that is. Because I wanted to put magic weapons on uh, one of the classes. Yeah, I did, actually. I wanted to put on one of the classes. In fact, actually, that reminds me. Um, I might actually use the Witcher class next season, so I'll have to remember to put <laughs> a shitload of oils on for him. That'll be awesome. Right, well anyway, I'll increase our weapon damage, so we'll keep that handy for later on. So now we're going to come down this way. I think that's an empty... I think... Hmm. Alright, we'll go check out that room next. Oh, I should speak to which. That's your way. I was going to use the bandages. It's because I saw this and I thought, oh, we can use bandages. Deeds. Some reward. Uh, deeds. Well performed. Do you know what? Let's pop the oil. Resisted the potion fever. Very nice. The resolve experience doesn't matter because I'm not planning on beating this dungeon in one go. In fact, like I mentioned, if we could just take the, the buffs, like pretty cool now. Now, is the buffs for one battle or is it for one round? It's one battle. Okay. That should be useful. Okay, let's head down this way. Now, I'm gonna have to be careful because the. Uh, the crocodilian is here somewhere, I think. Okay, so there's nothing in here, so this is a clean room. Alright, no problem. Uh, so yeah, so the crocodilian is the crocodile boss that we fought in the first time when we were coming into the courtyard. That pretty much uh, nearly destroyed us. <laughs> that was fun. Um, there is a level 3 and a level 5, I think. Now see, the thing is though, I'm not sure if the crocodilian is on the next uh, boss fight run. But uh, I, it's definitely on this one. Uh, I just passed a curial, didn't I? I did. Nope. Well, I did. Okay. Actually, do you want I'm thinking about taking some curial wounds for Howie? Howie? Ah, uh, no, it's okay. We'll save him for an emergency. I don't like wasting items. Okay. Um, I think we're best going down because the thing is, though, there will be a path that's continuously going forward this way, right? Problem is, there's gates, right? This is what I remember. So, there's gates in different locations. And we need to go from point A to point B to point C to point D in order to get different keys to unlock different gates. So that's why I'm trying to explore every possible area at the same time. Wrong thing. I meant to use the bandages, not the blood. And because I did that, now we have a fight. Right. <laughs> well done, Daffy. Fucking misclick as per usual. Christ. I'm not streaming yet. I'm making mistakes. Okay, so we've got an Esquire, which Esquires are really yeah, they were really bad. Um, and to be honest, to, to some degree, I actually want to get them down now, so let's move forward. But we got marked, so that's fine. We can use collect bounty. Okay, not fine, not fine. That's stress down. Uh -huh. Right, let's give a major heal to Howie. Thank you very much. Yeah, just realize the solar crown doesn't make much of a difference because we have a torchlight, have we? No, we haven't. 
Oh, that should be fine. Not to mention, we got level 3 equipment, so we should be more in the match for these guys now. He says. Okay, let's brace the gun. We get that armor piercing going on. And let's do this. Nice. As the fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. Okay, bomb run. Uh, is that bleed? It is bleed. Alright. Let's go. Um, right, let's use push to kill like wounds just to pick you up. Nice crit. And then let's go for a clip bounty on you. Oh, oh, oh nice. <laughs> very nice. Very good. Very good. Very nice. Very good. Okay. Um, it's not fine. Another debuff to stress. Yeah, plus 60 stress. Yeah, I'm not joking. This um, Capricious, Capricious, whatever it's called, is really bad. Um, Fringe of Blighted, Tenacious, yeah. Okay, let's go for a party heal, everyone. Okay, you're still craving, that's fine. Don't stress, don't stress. See me? 10 stress, just like that. Okay, 16, leave it at 1 HP, that's fine, because we can finish it off and then that's it. Good to go and drop, so. Okay, we've got key, 250 gold, we'll take 250 gold. Um, let's give you the... Hmm. Do you know what? Who's got the higher crit chance? That's a good question. Who's got the higher crit chance? How do I say that? Six, five, seven... Okay. Let's give the spirits to the Janassary. Because the Janassary will get 5% crit, bringing it up to 12, right at the bottom. And then we can take the crest. I don't think we need the key in our fairness, so no we do not. We don't need the key, we're good. Alright, let's move forward. Obviously the bleed will solve itself, but oh, okay, hello. <laughs> hello, corpse <it's> here. <laughs> hello. Okay, uh, yeah, we'll do a party healer actually. Actually, maybe a stress would have been, a stun would have been better, but it's fine. I will, yeah. We're gonna get stressed to high heaven now. Okay, um... See, I would love Caltrops to hit the first position, but fortunately that's a no-go. Clap Bounty, I think it's probably best if we do that first. Yeah. Yeah, I think it's best if we focus on the Corpse Eater first. No, um... We have a... 20-35... We got 155 base stun chance. Minus 70, that is near enough a 75% chance again. Maybe 80. Can we stun him? Nope, resist it. Of course. I've got. Ooh. Ooh, okay. As long as we're not marked. Oh, yeah, we are marked. That's going to be even worse next turn. That's why I wanted to stun him. Okay, let's brace the gun. And then let's get an arc of a shot. Nine. Nice. So, yeah, just focus firing on him for time. I mean, I could focus on the Slavering Ghoul, I mean, sure, but to be honest with you, it's best if we just focus on this guy first. That's what, that's one of the main, like, strategies I'm trying to do with this season, is I'm trying to focus fire on certain enemies at a time. Sure, we might be getting a lot of stress, however, I, this guy is the importance right now, that's why I'm trying to uh, establish with the, uh, the runs from now on. Of course, RNG is another big thing as well. There we go. So we got one down. So now we need to focus on the goal. And we're going to bring him forward, I think. Yeah, that's our skull thing. Mm. Alright. Okay, okay, okay. That's a seven. Okay, Howie. Um, is there anything we want to use? Push and heroism. That increases aim and saving throws. Uh, okay, let's go for another scroll bless. Just to increase our accuracy if possible. So come hither. Not only will it mark him, but it might bring him forward. It does as well. Very nice. Okay, let's go. Attack. Seven. Yeah, 40% prot. Okay. Hey, we heal. Not bad. I might have to call it a... Uh, I know this might sound odd, but I might have to call it a run suit because... We are getting stressed to high heaven and we do not have any uh, stress healing. <laughs> cheers, Cal, though. Cheers, pal. <laughs> You're supposed to be a paladin of tear <laughs> to defend the, uh, the weak in your attack in a vessel. <laughs> sure. Boom, <Firm> down. <laughs> okay, actually, that's, this came at a very good time. The state of her. It's almost like the game knows exactly what I need at what time. That's beautiful. Minus 35% stress relief. Alright, we'll take a torch. 
We'll take the crest and we'll take more gold. Perfect. All right. Okay. Let's keep heading down then. I'm sure we should be running into. Okay, who's Craven? You're Craven now. All right. We've got one bit of blood left, so I'm hoping that uh, we can recross some blood soon. Like a winemaker's reserve, maybe? We'll see. Okay, so we're scouting, so we've got to the right here. Okay, let's keep moving. Okay, I believe... Okay, you're wasted, so you need to use it, unfortunately. Let's go see. Oh, I hate that so much. I hate that so much. Okay, uh, bequeathed buffer, 25%. Have I not already got that? Sure, I've got that, but sure, okay. Yeah, I'm gonna have to watch them because uh, Cador's wasting, so I might have to call it an early run. I wanted to use that blood on him, but of course, I had the menu open, as per usual. Right, let's try and maybe. No, I should. Technically, should be fine, I think. But we'll have to see. Because apparently, like, I still have a good major, good major amount of ticks. So we'll see how we'll see what we can do. Obviously, I don't want to push more up, but we shall see. We shall see. Okay, I think we're better off. Oh yeah, this is a really bad fight actually. Is there anything we can do? Um, potion of magic weapons. Sure, let's use it. One base damage. So we're doing uh, six to thirteen. It's not too bad. Do you know what? Actually, we could probably. Yeah, let's stack it up actually. Okay, we beat the potion. Nice, we beat the resistance for the potion fever. So now we're rocking. Oh, oh, all oh, right. Okay, so it's not a cumulative, huh? All right, I thought maybe it was. Potion heroism gives us uh, resistance and accuracy. That's fine. I'm giving it to Howie because technically he's our hardest hit party member, but now anyway. Let's imagine we have to be careful here, actually. Yep, we have to be careful. But again, we'll see if my little tactic of focus fire will work. Wait, uh huh. Okay, real blast. Stunned. Yeah, that's my healer stunned. God, I really. Yeah, this is a hard fight, this. I remember this one from uh, the beginning. Right, we just got to go on the offensive here. I try not to min roll, honestly. Okay, I think Caldor will hit the front row. I think Howie can hit the third. And Bevan can hit the third as well. So we can focus on the third and the first and then just try and just wilt them down the best we can, really. Ten. Okay, I'll for 13 at least. Yeah, you're stunned. Doesn't matter what you do. Um, Alright, give her the blood. Dodge, good dodge. Do we need to use potion shield of faith? Do we need to use healing potions? Possibly. Um, right, let's use you. Use, yeah, use one for you. And then we can go smite. 15, we'll take it. Very nice. There's a big difference between. A big difference between 6 and 16. That's a big, massive min max roll that, I'll tell you that much. Okay, some trade skewer. I should stun him, I think. Nope, speed. Alright, wrong. Okay, yeah. Let's use another CLW. Just to give a little bit of top up. And then what we can do is we can go collect bounty, work on you. Neat. Okay, we need a single heal to keep you topped. Very nice. That came at the right time. Subterranean skewer. Alright. Uh huh. We're bleeding, I'm blasted, I'm blasted, I'm bleeding. Wow, it's executed. Well, it does have, uh, what? 21% crit, apparently. Cool. Okay, um, let's... Do we need to do stress relief? Possibly. Yeah, I've got to do some stress relief here. Okay, um, uh, right. Take the blood. Yeah, take the bandage, sorry, is what I might say. Finish you off. Nice. Six. We take the other bandage, you take a push and kill like wounds. And let's go for fight to heal all. Nice crit. Okay. Keep piling on the damage. Get all the blood. Yep, that's a six. And then I think we'll just carry on with the stress heals. Okay, how we don't miss. Eight. Good, good. 
it's fine, like enchanted side, yep, oh. Um, another one of these, please, keep us topped. Sedated. Dodge. It's all for a dodge, though. That would've been nice. And of course, Bavin's got the fucking Crimson Curse, and I can't we all got the Crimson Curse. <laughs> oh, wow, okay. Alright, there we go. Alright, so prizes, 800 gold, which you can take, we're taking another emerald, and we're taking all next nice. This is a slow and insidious killer. Okay, then. Okay, so can we go down the way? Can't go down the way. Right, um, alright. We'll try one more room, we think. I think we should be alright for one more room, and then... Or one more battle, so do I have a shovel? I don't have a shovel. Okay, we'll come back for the shovel, then. We'll try this room, and then we'll come back for a shovel, so I've got to remember to take a shovel into this place. Now, technically, I could do a second run, actually, because we got a lot of other people at level 3 now. Which is possible. So we could probably do another run. I mean, we do have our weight and gold. We have our prices back, our money back from buying things, so that's not too bad. Um, also, we've got 16 food. Actually, John, we should really use some of this food up, actually. Just a little bit. Just enough for two hunger checks. There we go. And all of a sudden, we're fine on... Yeah, I was going to say, all of a sudden, we're fine on uh, health again. But it's a stress cell problem. Okay, um... Okay, let's just come hither. Just for the mark of anything. Box for two rounds, so we can take advantage of that if we can. Howl. Yeah. Stress is going to be a problem. So we'll see. We'll see what we can do. Okay, uh, let's go for Dazzle Might to see if we can stun him. Perfect. Okay, um, I guess we're only smiting this guy. Okay, then we can brace the gun. I don't think there's any battle items I want to use. Push and sure, let's go push and arrows and increase accuracy. And we'll try and focus on this guy the best we can. Nice. One more attack will do. Boom. Yep, yeah, not too bad, not too bad. Um, okay, let's go for... Okay, he's, he's refused to healing. <laughs> That's not the best, dude. Howie, 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 you bad, bad, bad man. Alright, Skull Toss. I had a feeling, I knew that was going to happen. Right, 15, Jesus Christ. And she's almost over as well, but let's try and get this guy down first. Okay, uh... Uh-huh. Okay, we missed. That's bad. Um, do you know what? Let's go Song of Valor, actually. Because it's too a heal, but we do have a buff to do 30% uh, more stress healing. Which we are going to need in a second. Yeah, she's green as well. Yeah, I'll say we get to the room and then we'll pull it there, I think. Nice. Size has no intrinsic merit, mm -hmm. unless in order okay, so we've got Boss and Jade. Um, okay, we've got Full Up. Full Up, Full Up, Full Up. Um... Do you want to take anything? No, alright. I just want to get to the room and see what it is. We should, yeah, I think we'll do this fight at this room and then we'll leave or we'll fight whatever it is. Okay, it's that. Hmm. Actually, yeah, let's go here. We're stressed to high heaven and we have a lot of, uh, a lot of, a lot of health left. You know. loss, whatever. But we did get some gold with 5,653, which ain't too bad, and a bunch of crest. <laughs> yeah. Five boss, three deeds, and 18 crests. Alright, let's see, we got some quarks. What have we got? Okay, so we got Filthy, which is 5% disease resist plus 10% stress. We're gonna get rid of that. Necromania, fascinate corpses, ruminator, minus 10% stress seal received. Off guard, 4%, minus 4% speed in first round, minus 5 dodge in first round, and we have a cultist. 20% damage versus Eldritch, minus 40% stress for any enemies, Eldritch, and 15% stress. Good times. Alright, so mm, there wasn't exactly a good progress in all fairness. It's just that I was missing a uh, shovel thing. But this. This is amazing. 
Okay, so, supply run. Meet met at the bridge by a jubilant crowd. The caretaker credits a thick fog and an early departure time for the wagon's safe arrival. Yeah. So, supply costs minus 50%, provision costs minus 50%. That's, that's amazing. Okay, so Big B's first in for the blood, Daffy's first in for the blood, Damien's controlled the urges, Costa's controlled the urges, and of course we have that. Okay then, right. Well. So like I said, we do actually have another level 3 party that we can take. Do we? I thought we had another level 3 party, didn't we? We have like, a level. One, two. Yeah, we do. We have another level 3 party that we can take. Uh, we have Stukov, Elizabeth, Mistreus, and we have Tranchant. So let me see what that would look like. So Elizabeth up front. We have Stukov in position 4. We'll have Mitravis in the three. And we have Trashin in number two. All the damage will be coming from Elizabeth. Some support slash movability with Stukov. Which for some reason he doesn't have spell plague anymore. Huh. Yeah, he doesn't have spell plague anymore. Interesting. Um It's possible. It's possible we could do another Baron run. We've got two invites left, and we've only got one left. Which I think I might do that, actually. I think I might just meet as a Baron episode. Yeah, do you know what? Let's do that. Let's do that. Let's do the Baron stuff. Yep, we'll do Baron for today. Okay, then, right. So, let's go back to Stressicles. Right, let's get these guys de-stressed if we can. We've got 14,000, so we'll have to be careful of that. Eve, um, you go in here. Not a girl. If you want to upgrade, uh, we can upgrade the... Yes, let's upgrade the transept. A little hope, however desperate, is never without worth. Yeah, it's a little, uh, it's a little less. I'll do. Right, ten grand. Okay. Let's see. Hold on. How much is it to get drunk? Thousands. A little too much for my opinion. All right, we can wait and know then. Okay, I think we have, uh, skills upgraded. Not really, um... Really have anything to sell. Okay, so this is it. Heritage reward, 25% resolve XP, plus 10 props of HP plus 50. Alright, so it's the same thing. But they stack with each other, so we've got 20 prot if HP below. Oh, this is below, this is above. Huh, that's interesting. I think I'd rather take the uh how much is this? That's two grand. Sure. We'll sell that one. Genasserie, we don't have a melee genasserie anymore since one died. Yeah. Um, sugar cubes. Do you want them? Do you know what? No, nope, we'll sell that one as well. It's like selling a good one in my opinion, so we'll get a little bit of something back. Okay, uh, let's upgrade Stukovs. Uh huh. Elizabeth. To be honest, we're only using these two abilities, on fairness. So we can save a bit of money there. Herbicide will get up. Um, the herbal infusion will get up as well. It'll be useful. And the Travis is alright, okay. Now let's look at equip. Yeah, definitely level three. Okay, we can save the uh the, the weapon for another time. Okay, what do we have in terms of trinkets? So we have incantation. Okay. What's this? From zero to hundred stress, one accuracy per eight stress, one percent crit per twelve stress, and one speed per twenty stress. Minus 33% stress received. Okay, hold on. Let's do the math. So, 100 stress, we would have a total of, let's say 8 is 10. Sorry, 80 is 10 accuracy. 11 is 88. So we're talking roughly around 12 for accuracy. 12, 24, 36, 48, 60, 72, 84, 96. Say, what's that? 9 plus 9% crit and plus 5 speed. I don't think that's a very good trinket, in my opinion. Okay, Hunter's Enemity. Uh, 1% speed, 6% crit, 20% damage for Zeiss 2 and above. That's nice. It's 4 accuracy and not marked. Inquisitorial Matters, 3% crit for Zeiss Holy, 10% crit for the room. That's not too bad. And Raptor Charm, yeah. Interesting. Okay, now. 
All right, then. here we go. Now let's go do our second iron one. I think. Okay then, right. So we do have a little bit more to work with. I just realised I did not have my pace cam. There we go. I thought I did. Pardon me. Okay, right. So we have the blood. Mm -hmm. That's coming from the um, the Duchess. Let's think for a second. Then. Okay, so we've got two wild berries, six potion to cure wounds, two scrolls of bless, two ritual daggers, and two scroll of the. Right. Let's get. So I'm gonna get one. I'm gonna get one thing of food, actually. Actually, maybe it's a little bit more. Yeah. Yeah, it's two. Yeah, it's two checks, though. There's two checks. Um, let's get four torches, I think we'll do. We'll get two shovels, because we need to take shovels last time. We'll take some more bandages. We'll grab one more vial of blood. And we'll grab just some distal herbs, I think. Yep, sounds good to me. Alright, let's go. Ooh, 12. Um. Well. I'm not planning on doing the whole dungeon. We'll stick with eight. It's fine. What's the worst? What's the worst that can happen? There we go. I'm telling you, my I keep thinking my hotkeys are not working properly. <laughs> Seriously, I keep thinking my hotkeys are not working properly. Hmm. So <clears throat> we do. Oh shit! I didn't even put my timer on. I don't even put my fucking time on. God damn it. <laughs> Man, this goes to show how out of uh, how out of things I am. Uh, okay, let's go. Sure, we'll go 35. That'll do. Alright. As I was saying, we're actually doing okay, actually. That's some stress relief. That's fine. It's happening what we need. Okay, I said left and I said down. So, we do have a quite a healish team. Now, we don't have damage as well, so that's going to be the main facts for us. Now, we do have Elizabeth. Elizabeth can dish out a lot of the damage, but it all depends. It all depends indeed. But we'll see. We'll see. We should be fine. We should be good. Yeah. Okay. Shuffle. Mm hmm. Okay, I'm not too sure what this is about. That's a stress relief. We don't need to use that yet. Okay, let's see what's in this room. Okay, skeleton. So we got up or down. Let's go down first. Okay, we've got a trap. Okay, who's got the best trap? So I'm 60, 60, 60. Okay, let's see. We'll let Elizabeth do it because she can heal herself, so it's not too big of a problem. Okay, that's a shovel, but we're not going to interact with that, because we've only got one left. Okay, so that's our first hunger check, which is odd, because we didn't have a hunger check last time. No, we did not. Okay, this room's empty. Alright, that's fine. So we've got a battle, and then a curio. So yeah, I think our first key's roughly around in this area here, I think, if I remember correctly. Alright, so another trap. I feel like we dodged it. Okay, game. Alright. Alright, it's like, oh, you got lucky with the first one. Okay, quarter sun and two blood suns. That is fine. Okay, let's go for a bonk. Just to stun her, if she can, but missed. Imagine bonking something that large. Okay, um, right. I guess we'll go Demon's Pool. Guess gets up front. We could dodge that as well. Alright. Um, okay, let's go. Chance reprisal. Get the repost up, and hopefully, don't attack her. Okay, Midnight Mouette. That's 25 damage. That's bad. But 16 accuracy. Hmm. That's interesting. Six minus 16 accuracy. I wonder what the point of that is. Alright, is this a stun? Uh -huh. Launch. Okay, good dodge. Okay, that didn't dodge. Right. Blight, of course. Right, um, let's go herbicide. Uh, Blight's 120. But we can herbicide the the uh, quartz in the back. Of course, she resisted. Oh, those whispers. God damn it. Festering fear consumes yep. the mind. Okay, let's go for a single heal. Let's wait to crit. Very nice. Munch. We've got the past. Okay. 
was distracted with I snatched some goods. What were you doing? Ah, plus you killed winter. Yes. <laughs> well done. Ah, Filcher. <laughs> that was interesting. So Filcher, so he stole the, the Kool-Aid wounds and now he's got potion for you. Brilliant. Kill them. Uh, scroll of Bane, scroll of Bless. Let's go scroll of Bless Bane to lower accuracy, even more actually, apparently. Um, and then we'll go up this totally for the guy back. Six, we'll take it. Okay, let's go Charles of Reprisal. Keep the Apostle. Gone. And then herbicide. Come on, get through the bleed. Bleed, sir. Nice. Let's finish it. As the fiend falls. This artillery. Um, right, let's do a party heal all, just to keep everybody topped. I guess it's going to be another one of these. And actually, if we hit, we can just go. I was going to say, if we hit the minimum, dice the play anyway. Come on. Nope, one person. Hmm. Mm. Mm. That was not good. That was not good whatsoever. The other power of potion. Guard break. Uh huh. Uh, right. Let's go. Vulnerability hex. Go for dodge. If we can. Uh, we'll go party heal just to keep everybody topped. Uh, sure. If you want to go handle light. <laughs> you like this advantage. Give them no quarter. Okay, not bad. Not bad, not bad start, not bad start. Okay, like I said, stress is going to be a bit of a problem, as well as DOTs, but we should be okay. Now, I could have used a herbal injection, but it's fine. Okay, now this is what we use, want to use the blood for, I think. No, 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 it's the other one. It's the guy with the hood inset, it is. No. We want to use a bandage there. And baubles, paid for in blood. Okay, um, let's go to the right this time. Thin. We can come back and go to the. We can come back and go to the north afterwards. Hmm. Okay, let's go south. Okay, spooders. Should be easy enough. Okay, let's go herbal infusion so we can heal ourselves next turn. Actually, why do I have a feeling that was a good time to do that? <laughs> <laughs> kind of was actually. Yeah, dodge. Uh -huh. Um, you drink, you drink. I don't cure your wounds. Sure. Do what you do. Do what you do best, I guess. Yes, okay, conformability hex to remove that dodge. Uh huh. And then we'll do a single heal just in case. Just in case these guys get wise. Dodge, but the pass kicked in. Nice. Web. Okay, that's a mark and a stun. And then we need to get this overgrown spitter down. In fact, we can actually probably kill him now, actually. Nice. Go on, I love a bit of the offensive. Okay, and then we can go herbicide. Let's blight them. Oh no, he resisted blight. Hmm. That was an unlucky roll. Okay. Okay. Blight. Surges as the enemy crumbles. Mm, yeah, that hurt. unbalanced. That hurts indeed. Okay, uh, herbal infusions. So get rid of the blight as well. Fifth <laughs> power potion. What are you doing? Debuff, huh? All right. Uh, let's go for ability hacks. I was gonna say remove the dodge, but missed. <laughs> sure. Yeah, dodge that. <laughs> dodge this. Okay, so another 1,000 gold. Lovely. Push on okay, let's go kick in. Oh, crit 20 on the herbal infusion. Very nice. That was actually really, really nice. Okay, even more skeleton. Jesus Christ, how big is this place? Alright, so we got Battle of Curio. Sure, we'll come down this way, see what this is about. Okay, so we got Trap. Find it, or is it? There it is. Okay, um, I'm gonna try it with Stukov. Nope, we failed. Mind okay, it's not too bad, I guess. Alright, let's see what's about. Oh, yeah, I think this is where the key is, I believe. Okay, mind 
wine. Mm -hmm. Alright, so we've got a guard going on. Mm -hmm. What are you drinking now? <laughs> I'm telling you. This guy. This guy. Okay, first auxiliary. Let's go herbicide. And you. Try and get our light going. Okay, and then I think we will go with challenge of surprise, right? Dodge. Yeah, I know it's 25% dodge there. Um, let's try and go for Dazzle and Light, see if we can skip his turn. Oh, he does any damage. Nope, resist. Here comes the pain. Here comes the pain! <laughs> God, I love that slip mouse. I can't remember if it was sick or Pulse of the Maggots. One of the two. Is it Pulse of the Maggots? Maybe. I'm not sure. I might be sick, actually. Yeah, I think I might be sick. Because what's well, oddly enough it's that um that song which has that audio file that goes it goes main for the main kick, the main riff kicks in. Funny enough, uh, that's actually a clip it from a uh, the actor that plays Scarface, one of his films, and he says it I believe. I might be wrong there, if I am I do apologize. But I'm sure it is what I think it is. Right, um Dodge. Yeah, this could be a fucking god awful, goddamn awful bloody Fight this! Alright, let's try Demon's Pool if we can. Try and manipulate the backline a little bit. Nope. Oh! There's no way it's got 270. 270 move resist. Okay, got 10 health there. Very nice. Alright, he's gone from the blade. Gently. Not bad. But we're gonna have to watch um, Vestal here because Vestal is about to go over into distress. Yep, Flash is going over now, and... Nice. Big risk to take it. Adversity can foster hope and resilience. Cool. Right, let's try another one of these if we can. Dodge, wow. I'm trying to get blind them. Okay, let's bleed. Uh -huh. Okay, well... Okay, we got hit there. Um, let's go party all. You see, healing's not a problem. Healing is not a pro- <sighs> Shoot off. You're an alke, pal. You're an absolute alke. Um, right, tell you what, let's go... Scroll of Bless so we can help. Yeah, let's go Scroll of Bless. I've got a bit of that. It seems to up our accuracy a little bit. Uh, sure. Got this artillery, hit the back line. First. Uh-huh. This is the Crimson Gutters. Very nice. Let's try and go for a bong instead. Nope. Alright. Uh, stun? I don't know. Just on you. Does it work? Alright. One personal, but we got a stun at least. How quickly the tide turns. Yeah, this is... This is getting really, really bad, this. I still think we can do it. I still think we can do it. Do you know what? I have never. Do you know what? I have never seen the mark used. Huh, interesting. Um, do you know what? Let's transform. This might tick over Sukov, actually, I think about it. We could bypass guard anyway. I should really be doing that, shouldn't I? Get extra damage in. Definitely. Take the power of the potion. Debuff. Whatever that is, no idea. Graduation, I guess. Fine pallets. Yeah, he's going over. 97 out of 100. Bombing run. Uh huh. Okay, we'll take another one of these if we can. 15. Not fine, uh huh. Stun? Nice, got stun. Love it. Okay, um, let's go for a Demon's Pool if we can. Just trying to move things around. Okay. Trajan, please can we go for a bonk? 
Really? No one wants stuff out the sacred flame. Ooh, nice shield stuff. I'll take it. There we go. Dead by torchlight. <laughs> Need drink now? Wow, he's wasting all the potions, isn't he? Yes. Okay, moment build six in. Dodge. Okay, Elizabeth. Nom nom. Really? Really? There we go, finally, the bonk pill. Take it. Alright, not bad. Can we take it then? Can't. Uh, white. Alright, we'll leave that because in here, if I'm not mistaken, it's a key. And we have the red key, Key of Anger. Only for rage will the passage open, so we need to take this with us, unfortunately. So, let's go for... Okay, let's go for a scroll of bless. Yeah, there we go. She so got a spell plague, and that is for one battle. All right, so we can take this one first. Even the okay, no, if I'm not mistaken, we have to come back here. Then, so that's what we're going to do. We're going to avoid these rooms, and then we're going to come to the gate and use it. Oh, she so got this. Focused. Oh wow, two moment of clarity. Two virtues. Oh my god. Hey, I will take it. This means we can go a little longer. This means we can go a little longer indeed. Okay, so we need to come all the way back, and uh, yeah, I could look into every room as well, but to be honest, I want to use this key right now. See, by using this key, it means that it'll save us up in inventory space. See, the reason why is because if you choose to leave with the key, the key goes into the, uh, the estate section of the provisions, right? And... What that means is, every time you come into the Crimson Court, until you go to the gate to use it, you have to bring it with you, so that is that's a, a valuable inventory slot. Unless, of course, you're using... Excuse me. Unless, of course, you're using some kind of a uh, inventory mod. But, nope, we're doing things for Nola. Oh, it smells like I'm tempted to use an inventory mod next year. I don't know. I don't know, I'm, I'm constantly thinking about different mods to use next year. I mean, honestly, like, every October I will be doing some form of a Darkest Dungeon stream, or series, one way or another. Recording streams, half and half, one or the other, you know, I will give you guys some Darkest Dungeon content. I know this game has a huge following, and I know you, game, I know you guys love this game as well, so, you know, if I can provide it one way or another, I will. Nope, I'm going the wrong way, bastard. I meant to go the other way. <laughs> I meant to go left, not right. Great, so that's more stress ticks. Alright. Uh, it's fine, it's fine. Um, yeah. So if you guys are wondering about the um, the layout over the next few years, touch what I am doing this for the next couple of years or so. Um, season 3. Season 3 is going to be um, Color of Mantis, or Prince of Quartz. Different classes, different stuff. Um, I will not be using the same classes again. You know, Duchess, um, Bombard. I don't know, if I don't get a Bombard class this season, I might bring it back again next season to see if we can use it. So the botanist, no uh, Reforged, definitely, definitely no Reforged classes. I'll have to remember that. So we'll see. But yeah, but basically a whole new like mod list to some degree. Alright, yeah, so we can use the key, and there we go, it's open. Now do we go in? Because I think the crocodilian is around here. I stress. What have we got to lose? Okay, skeleton. Alright, so it's just a path forward, right? It is. Okay, let's keep moving forward. See, the layout is, um, this is going to come out, oh, actually. Right, so it's going to come out here, and then it's going to be a crossroads here, I think. Right, so we go up and down. I believe if we go up this way, it turns into a fork, like that, right? And then the same goes the other way around. But if we go further down, there will be another gate here. And then once we find the key for that gate, which I believe is up here, what happens is it turns into a little bit of a box here. And then when we get to this room here where the box is, this room in the center is where the Baron is. And then once we beat the Baron, we get another key. And then behind him is a very, very nice chest of trinkets, I believe. All right, that's the last uh, food. Okay, we'll see what we can do. Okay, so what's valuables? If nice. only treasure could staunch the flow of otherworldly corruption. That's it. 
Okay. Um, skeleton. Okay, I think we want to go forward here, right? Ah, right. Oh, hold on. So it is possible. Hold on. So it is possible. Oh. So it's possible to avoid the keys altogether, is it? Interesting. Okay. Not too bad. Not so bad. Not so bad. Okay. Slaving Gruel, two quartz eaters. Alright, we can do this. We can do this. Eh? Okay, we're all good. It's all good old gravy. Get some blight going. Very nice. Um, Alright, let's try and go for a stun if we can. It's a big ask, but maybe. Nope. Was not. Um, right, let's go for a Demon's Pull. Try and bring him forward if we can. Sure. Because I don't want him in the back row with that skull toss. Alright, never mind. Okay, munch. We're going to get a lot of blight, so I'm going to have the botanist stand by for that. Yeah. That's what I mean. 20 stress. Now, luckily, we got our virtue already, so it's not too bad. But anyway, let's go transform. Because we need to get these guys down, like, right now. We'll start nomming on guys at the front. Yeah, she's gone over 100. Was this a disease? <laughs> what disease can he give off? Interesting. Okay, for to heal. Nice. Got some more blight. So it's 12 per round. That's the thing as well, like, if we just keep blighting them up with the botanist, he will die eventually. Oh, stick off. <laughs> Using all our stuff. Okay, do you know what? Let's go for mobility axe, yeah, give it a that dodge. First of all, see why not. Okay, munch, 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 munch. Yep, see, 12 damage. All he needs to do is take one more blade attack and it's done. So we'll see if the botanist can roll a, a better initiative next round. As she does as well. And lands, and... Oh, resisted this time! You schmuck. You schmuck. Okay, let's see if we can do at least two damage. What we did as well. Nice. Yeah, he's done. He's done. Okay, and then... I don't know. One really to X again, I guess. He ruined the dodge, a little bit of damage. And then we'll go feed the beast. That's a kill. And three, two, one. Bonk. <laughs> there we go. Okay, we'll take what we can. Okay, so we've got one more emerald. I would not mind taking the emerald. Okay, um, no, I do have one last food left. I will be honest with you. So what we're going to do is we're going to get to the room. I think we've got a battle here. Obviously, it's a battle, so we're going to see what it is. I think. Is this what I think it is? Is this the, uh... Yep, as a thought, crocodilian. Unnatural and abhorrent. Okay, crocodilian, how to deal with But, should be good, right? Should be fine, should be fine. Let's see what we can do. Okay, well, can't really do anything, so what we're going to do is we're going to get a body heal, keep everybody top if possible, and we're going to have to get ready to run if need be. Just saying. Now, the problem is we don't have a back attack, so, I don't know, we can't really do anything right now, so let's get some preemptive, uh, with purple infusions, I think. Let's give some preemptive ones. So on corruption. Uh-huh. Unfortunately, I ain't gonna knock him forward that, so. Right. Let's so feed the beast. Feed the beast. Yeah, see. Can't really do anything. We can't really attack the back either, so I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. Let's use um first of power. This is gonna increase our Gonna buff our healing, I think. Like in fear. Yeah. This is gonna hurt. So we've got wild berries. Okay, let's use scroll of bane. I'm gonna use torchlight. Can we move him? Possibly. Yeah, let's move him. Nice. That's what we want. Okay, um, let's go for. Vulnerability X, remove that, uh, remove that dodge. Resist it. Okay, let's go feed the beast. Dodge. Yeah, that's why I wanted to remove it, if possible. We stun him. It's a hard ask. Okay, stunned for one action, not two, remember that. He's got two actions. Okay, uh, Blight is 100%. 
I mean, it's possible. Yeah. T freak. 40. Ouch. Yeah. So we try and remove that. That sees a 95% debuff. See, we can. Here's the thing, though, right? Ooh, actually, I just remembered. Here's a torch. Yeah, increases our accuracy. So, here's the thing, though. Um, what was I going to say? Yeah. So, we can out heal his damage. We can heal up his damage to near enough the same level. So, I'm not worried about that whatsoever. Because, again, we do have three pseudo healers. We've got the botanist for emergency regens. The Vessel's the main healer, of course, and obviously Shukov for support and heal himself. Like I said, damage is going to be a big thing here. If we can hit the fucking thing, that's the thing. Now, he is moving a lot, so that's fine. I mean, look at that. Protection and damage. Ugh. Yeah, see? I mean, his movement's only 55%, so with a better look for Shukov, we can move him to the front again. Maybe a bit of luck, we can actually stun him by bounty. Yeah, that's gonna hurt. Nine. And then move forward as well, which is bad. And oh, we don't have any. Oh, yeah, we do have bandages. That's okay. The bandages. T3. See what I mean? See what I mean? And it's moving her forward. Ah, oh, it's just moving forward as well. Oh, shit. Okay. Okay, let's do that. Let's do that a little bit. Do that a little bit. Okay, um, let's go for. And the light. Time. Nice. The yeah, handle is powerful, especially if we keep racking up the. Uh, yeah, especially if we keep racking up buffs as well. That's why I love about this festival because I'm not changing the skills. We have a little bit for everything. And we're doing a first for power, which I don't think so. We're going to be forward actually, so we need a second position. Here. Um, right, let's remove that bandage. Um, let's go for a healing fusion. Let's uh, do it on. Let's take off. Okay, sorry about that, folks. Just went to go play the toilet. Right, okay, okay then. Right, so I think what we're going to do is we're going to use a ritual dagger. That's going to give us a little bit of an extra 4% uh, HP healed. Okay, so I need to heal up the vessel. As mentioned, a little bit of a crit as well. Nice, nice done. Okay, so let's keep using hand of, yeah, hand of light. 10 damage, that's not bad actually. That's not bad damage. 6% damage. So this is the big one. Here comes the big one. Yeah. <laughs> yep, here comes the big one. Ouch. 18. Mm hmm. So we go for mercy. Uh huh. Alright, um. Choose another ritual dagger. Like a free bleed knife. Big heal, come on. 15, nice. See what I mean? Matching the seal a little bit. <laughs> okay, let's go feed the beast. Thank you, bit of damage, thank you. Okay, let's go handle light, 13. And again, we're just gonna get our buff more and more and more and more and more. It's amazing. Yeah, why are you doing that? Last potion should not have quaffed. Oh, it's a stumble. Oh shit, okay, that's not. That's not good. Well, get a dodge. He buffed the mean. Nope, it's a freak. Okay, it's nine. But we got an emergency heal coming in in a second, which isn't bad. Okay, um, let's move forward once we can get in position. Uh huh. Um, we could go for a bonk. There's a chance we could do it. Ooh, nice crit. And uh, we get the sun as well. Nice, okay. Yeah, let's not do anything this turn. Ah, uh, we'll blood festival in. Nice. Actually, that's pretty cool because we do this. Keep using her high damage if possible. Okay, now the problem is, however, that, yep. Yeah. Okay, um. First of power, probably it's first of the power of this. Fear. 
Is that the move back? It is move back. Okay, that's the stumble. Debuff. 10% damage taken. It's not what we want, but hey. Okay, do you want to go for you? Four. Alright, that's a bit crap, I'm sure. Okay. Let's keep using Hand of Light. Again, though. No. Slowly but surely. 11 damage. Alright. Okay, so she got me four this time. Check off Mercy. Uh -huh. Um, right. Now I heal onto the Botanist. So on corruption. That's what I'm worried about. Oh, okay, we dodged it on the important people. I'll take that. Nice. Okay, let's try a 100% light. It's 20% chance to make him light. At least for this, it's damage, I guess. I don't know. Again, there's no way to show it. Yeah, ravenous. Yeah, that's bad. Madness. That's bad. Old friend. Yeah. Now, we do have noble obligation. So we can move forward. That's not too bad. Submerge. Yeah, that's going to hurt. Hopefully... Okay. Um, let's get an emergency one of these in. Try it, try for a stun. We did. Nice. Okay, let's move back. Okay, that's not too bad. More debuffs. Uh huh. Let's try it. Okay, we can't do Demon's Pool. I don't even know why I try, you know. Yeah, I don't know why I try. Oh, nice crit. I'll take it. See, that's the problem, though. When he's lurking, he gets healed up. 17. Yeah, there's a death streak on some death door, but it's fine. It doesn't have any DLTs or anything. It's okay. So let's heal him up. But now he's on death door recovery, which isn't the best either, to be fair. Okay, we'll dodge. Nice crit. Oof. Okay, that was not good. Dodge. Alright. Okay, so you got to heal yourself. Eat, drink, eat, drink. Alright, what are you doing? Okay, this is herbs. It's fine. Um, right, let's go with destruction. Four. It's not the best. It's not the greatest either. Teeth freak. Seven. Yeah, we need to heal her up in a second. She can heal herself up, maybe. Not bad, not bad. Okay. Okay, um, okay, we'll return the favor, keep everyone at full the best we can. Okay, T freak, good dodge. Let's go for a bonk. Okay, free damage and a stun, maybe? Yep, nice, went through, went through. Okay, let's go, noble obligation. Oh, we can only use it on, oh, we can only use it on the first and second, huh? No, we can't use it on the first, I'm saying we can't use it on the first position target. Alright. That's not gonna work. Bye, y'all. Let's keep piling the damage a little by little. Jeff got commands me, what are you doing? 20 crit. Uh, 20 heal, <laughs> alright. Not needed, but sure. Nine. Okay, let's go for a. Just me. Oh, come on. Right, challenge reprisal. Wow, seventies. Okay. Seventies, I tell you, the seventies. Lucky fear. Yeah, that's a healing again. What, fifteen? No, it's not. Okay, it's just buffed. So for mercy, horror. Yeah. If only we can actually, like, seriously, like, if only we could damage the, uh, the bull rushes. Come on, land a blight, land a blight. It's 20%. Yeah, I gotta watch because she's about to stress over in a wee bit too. 
Okay, that was a random act out. It's not the best, but it's not the worst either. Right, let's try and go for a stun if we can. Okay, we've got the stun in. See, there's a 95% chance to debuff. That's 120 base. So really, you'd think that we should be able to land the, the, deb the debuff, which we don't. So in theory... <laughs> I was trying to reverse engineer the game then. Okay, come on. Good threat, good threat. That's what's up. Minimal or something. Okay, good. As long as we keep the repost and the damage coming in, it should be good. It's free. It's just stun. Submerge. Okay, so heals for what? Average of 15, I think. Yeah, 15. It's always 15 damage. Party all heal. I was just past, it wasn't a storm of uh, past attack, man. Let's quickly try and land that debuff. Wrong person, wrong person. Damn it. See, we're kind of stuck in an infinite loop here, an infinite loop. Good idea. Uh, right, move you forward. I'm gonna have to reshuffle all of it here. Oh, I might have to come out with a different party. Yeah, I'm gonna have to come out with a different party in the fields. Right, you come back two. There we go. Get her into the second position. You come back one. Okay, you use. Nice. It's going to be before it anyway. Take it. Because we're going to start focusing on damage now with the Vestal. Because we need this guy deadly right now. Okay, her confusion. Some corruption. Eight. Okay, we need to see once. We've got to keep an eye out for that. Ability X, come on, land it. Mart, debuff, yes! Get 17 dodge. Ow. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, abuse it, right. Okay, it's so now or never. Now or never. What are you doing? Don't, don't, don't. Injury and despondence. It's all falling apart, though. It's all falling apart. Poor cowardice. It's an attack. Submerge. Ah. Oh. Okay, well, let's retreat. Yeah, let's go. Let's go, let's retreat. This skirmish don't, may be don't. lost. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Are you alright? Yeah, she's lost all of her stress. Okay. That was close. Right, yeah, let's get out of here. We group down, look. Okay, that was a valiant effort. That was a valiant effort. And of yourself. It's just that... Uh, we just got bad... We just got some bad rolls. <laughs> we just got some bad rolls. Yeah, but to be honest, though, I mean... We didn't exactly have the party for it. We needed a little bit more on the damage side. So, yeah, I mean... The first group would have done alright. But, hey, that was a, like I said, that was a valiant... Valiant, but... It's fine. It's cool. Okay, so we've got weak knees. Minus 20% move resist of HP below 50%. Kafir unholy. 50% stress if any enemy is unholy. Minus 10. Desperation surge. Which you can't see what it is because text is blank. Okay. And warrior light. 10% damage if torch above 75. Cool. Cool. Alright then. Awesome. Okay, so we'll get set up for the next quest then. Um... There is a yeah. great horror beneath the manor. It's set up for the next quest. A crawling chaos. Okay, Bavin afraid, we covered 69 going. stress. Nice. You've meditated, we covered 50 stress. How we gone on a personal vision quest of cheap enlightenment, meditated and recovered 56. We strum, has controlled the urges, always first for blood, needs to control the urges, how he's first for the blood, drink of ile, drink of ile, drink of ile. Fuel then. Right then. Alright, let's see what we're doing then. Okay, so we do have one more 
invitation, but I'd rather wait until we get like two or three, so I guess the Baron's the hold it, I don't know. Okay, let's get rid of the group first. We can level up our level twos and level threes then. Okay, so we have Steadfast Boots, we have the Blood Curse Medallion, interesting. Oh, that's really cool actually. And we have the Perilous Concoction, we already have these to prefer. Or, actually, we could probably get some more blood actually. Yeah, do you know what? let's get some more blood actually, that'll do. Alright, so by level. Okay, so we've got a bunch of level twos. Um, and a bunch of ones, right, so look. So, Weestrom, Aloof, Arclight, and Bustoir. Alright, let's get Bustoir in. Um, Arclight, we'll get you in as well, see why not. We'll get Boral in, and we need somebody on the front line, which I think will be Fika. Hang on, okay. Yeah, so we've got Heal in the front. Yeah, this, this probably will do. That's probably what we do. Okay, let's go do our business. And then we can conclude it. And we can conclude tonight's episode. Which ain't too bad, actually. Which ain't too bad whatsoever, to be fair. Not too bad whatsoever. Okay, um, right. Also, we need to watch money. So, you go in there. You go in there, too. So, bows of each. Shukov, let's send you to the bar if we can. Yes, we can. Perfect. Right, and the rest is fine. And the rest is fine, yeah? The rest is a oh, bloody cave, you ask me. Right, okay, okay, no. right, well, I'll tell you what, let's go over equipment, um, I think we should be fine, we got level 1 stuff, we don't need level 2, because we're going into a level 1 dungeon, um, yeah, we can upgrade these, and that'll do, skills, we don't need to, we're alright, trinkets, yep, we've got one of those, skill ring, huh, 4% accuracy, 15% chance, all skill chances, minus 6 chance, 15% stress, okay, twitchy seaf, Plus speed, minus 10% HP, plus 10. Okay, interesting. Right, okay, okay then, right, I think I will end it here then. So yeah, so, hope you guys enjoyed the episode. It was pretty good, actually. Yeah, so, we made some more progress into the Baron, and we had to go out to Crocodilian. We got a good amount of damage on someone, but like I said, it's just that stress was a killer. And to be honest, with the bad rolls coming from Elizabeth, I think if Elizabeth hits a little bit more often, I think we would have killed him. But, hey. This one is. We'll come back with a stronger, more offensive team, and we can take them out. That's what I love about the uh, the, the courtyard quest. That the fact is that you can go in and obviously leave as long as you get invitations. But my point is, you can switch the team up depending on the situation. Obviously, if we had a more damage oriented team, we could take them out. But now we can next time, which is amazing. Right. So anyway, my friends, I'm gonna end it here for today. So thank you so much for watching. Please like and subscribe if you haven't already. Links down below, check them out if you wish, and apart from that, enjoy the rest of your awesome day, and hope to see you next time. Take care.